G'day, it's Richard Taylor here at the Weta Workshop. I'm actually in my office. I'm surrounded by piles of cool stuff. I couldn't imagine working in any other field than the one that I work in, the effects industry in Wellington, New Zealand. It's, rec it's, it's giving me an, an immense level of creative uh, wealth in my life where every morning I get to work, I can't wait to throw the door open on the Pandora's box that is this workshop. Originality, trying to do something different, trying to constantly uh, come up with something more special, more dynamic, more unique, and uh, come up with something that can inspire people that see the product that we make. We get approached often by makeup artists or people aspiring to be makeup artists or hair people or costume makers or props makers that say to me, well, how do I break into the business? And the simple answer, just start building a portfolio. And build a, a portfolio by giving before you expect to take. Find the young filmmakers that are aspiring to make fantastic product out in the world and uh, out, out here in New Zealand, of course, and, and team up with them. Give of your time, give of your enthusiasm, because what they're doing for you is they're packaging your work into a film, into a product that you can put in your portfolio. We hear often, yeah, but should I go to university? Should I do a tertiary education? What should I do to become a filmmaker? Basically, just go and buy or put together some gear and start being a filmmaker. Just start making it, start doing it the equipment uh, required to put together beautiful imagery and sound is easily accessible to you. On a cell phone, you know, even on something as small as this, people are shooting amazing uh, imagery. Utilize the fact that you can buy inexpensive equipment, turn to friends that have the skills to utilize the equipment that you don't know how to use, and then distribute it as widely as you can across the internet, hopefully reaching as many eyeballs as possible so people enjoy your entertainment as much as you enjoyed making it. And in turn, of course, the opportunities to build a creative career in this in most extraordinary of industries becomes a possibility and then a reality to you. Throw everything into it, all of your mind, your body, into trying to do something extraordinary. Never ever set off to do something substandard. There's almost no excuse anymore why someone shouldn't just start shooting cool stuff. It all just comes down to a great idea. Don't try and just do it by yourself. One of the most important things with filmmaking is it's a collaboration. Often there is an individual that's leading the vision and leading the drive of the idea but it's the coming together of an incredible group of talented people that make a movie. Peter Jackson doesn't make a Lord of the Rings or a King Kong or The Hobbit. He inspires an industry of people to a system to make these movies. Plan, plan and plan. Don't just grab the camera and think that you can run around the neighborhood shooting some stuff and uh, something great is going to come out of it. Put your heads together. Think about the shots you want to create. How do you stand out from the crowd? You stand out by telling original and inspirational stories in a totally unique way. Think about what your original and new ideas may be. See how they complement your story and then try and combine them to create something truly inspirational. And in turn, of course, you'll create something memorable that people want to watch again and again and again.